<coughs> in this video we are going to look at what kind of rule set we need to select for SAP BI and BW. So if you look at BW, uh, BW contains historical data which basically means uh, data which is not the current data but data which is, uh, is weeks old or months old or year old. So that data is brought in from ECC and other systems, SAP and non-SAP systems and it is getting consolidated into reporting. So BW and B or BI is mainly used for reporting. So there is no uh, functional transactions or there is no updates happening from BW in uh, except in certain cases where there are some updates happening and going back to ECC. But 99% of the time all the data you see is historical data. The purpose, uh, the focus in BW is mainly to uh, make sure the data is secured and not visible to many people uh, or everybody in the system. Okay. So the best option uh, for BI system is a basis rule set. Uh, one of the possibility is, uh, one of the things we have to do is, we have to also identify some of the sensitive transactions within BW and add it to uh, the critical risk rule set. So uh, if they have I any mean, interview questions, uh, if you are asked for about BW and BI, the best option is to select the basis rule set uh, and also uh, add additional transactions from uh, the BW related transaction to critical transactions. Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe and click on the link below to download the SAP GRC step by step guide. Thank you.